Well, tonight, an update. The FBI has joined the search for an 11-year-old Iowa boy who disappeared last Thursday in the same area where a college student was murdered while jogging nearly three years ago. CBS's Charlie DeMar is there. Investigators were seen today at the home of Xavier Harrelson in the mobile home park where he lived. They had more questions for the family of the 11 year old boy who went missing five days ago. It's been several days since he's gone missing. Uh, one of those nights was in the 30s. Uh, as more time goes by, uh, that's got to be troubling from your point of view. With the report that we have, what he was last seen wearing, a t-shirt and pajama bottoms and tennis shoes, that was a concern of ours. But as the days go on, it it, it's increasingly more suspicious and uh, and more concerning. Samantha Ricks is a family friend and says she notified police after Xavier's mom told her that her son was missing. I'm not stopping. I won't stop looking for that little boy. Just hoping that good news is brought and that, you know, he's returned to us safe and he's such a happy little boy. More than 500 volunteers and responders gathered over the weekend to scour the area. The search centered around here, where police say the boy was last seen Thursday. Nearly three years ago, this same Iowa community rallied to search for 20-year-old Molly Tibbetts, who was last seen out jogging. Her killer was found guilty of murder just last week. To be right back here, you know, working out of the sheriff's office and in the same communities as we were three, almost three years ago when Molly disappeared, it's, it's frightening. Now, foul play has not been ruled out. Investigators say that the family is cooperating, yet we have not heard from them yet. Nora? Charlie DeMar, thank you.